Oh, it's amazing. It's every, I think it's every sort of every Hong Kong player's dream to play in the sevens, and so to do well uh, is is also amazing. Sort of the culmination of a couple of years hard work, especially for the guys who were involved with the Asian Games in December in Doha. Um, uh, a couple of years ago, a lot of the uh, older players who've been in Hong Kong playing for the playing for the Hong Kong Sevens team left, and we're now left with quite a young side. Uh, a lot of the guys, I mean, Keith Robertson's only 20, turned 20 yesterday. Uh, um, I think our average age is something about 23. So we're we're learning, and uh, to do well, uh, to play, put in some good performances against Argentina, and uh, even in the second half against uh, USA, is, we're pretty pretty proud of. Uh, you, they can't be beaten. I mean, I've been to quite a few sporting events. I've been to Twickenham watching them play, and even here, like the, the, the car just get behind you so much. When you run through their tunnel, that, that there's no words. It's, it's, it's improving hugely. Um, when I first started playing for Kai Tak Tigers, uh, I think I was nine, about ten years ago, eleven years ago. It was almost a complete expat community playing. Uh, but now, if you go down to mini rugby, you'll find uh, a ridiculous number of local players. Just it's outstanding. And, um, and the girls' rugby is taking off. I think girls' rugby is the fastest growing sport in Hong Kong. I might be wrong, but it's, it's ridiculous. It's, 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 crazy. it's really good for rugby here. Well, we can only get better. I mean, we've got really good coaching staff and, and the guys are getting loads of uh, good experience. Roddy, uh, Roddy McIntosh, our coach, went down to train with the All Blacks to pick up a few things. And uh, Johnny Gabenda Charles, who's unfortunately leaving us, he was with uh, the Crusaders, I think, uh, picking up a few tips. And so those guys are behind us fully. We're getting the best rugby education we can here, actually. Uh, prepare. <laughs> Because I mean, some of those guys in that south stand—they're they're not feeling too good this morning. If you see them. <laughs>